Right, so <clears throat> the winter bike is back out on the ever dependable Swiss side wheels. The reason I'm doing this video is basically I can't believe how well these shift now. This is beautiful. New cables, new outers. I mean, a year and you leave it over the summer. You can hardly change gear now. It's like brand new. 2010, it's had five, six winters. Job done. Except for the cables, it's gone really slack. Oh, that is what? Right. Ah, let's put a bit of tension in that. It's obviously, uh, shouldn't be that slack. Woohoo! Ah, actually, you've not, you've not turned the gear, have you? Mm -hmm. School boy error. I don't know if you see it, I'm going to have to put it in my mouth. So anyway, a bit of cable slack, I think. Anyway, reason doing this video is I bought this little baby. And I've saved a tiny bit of weight. This was about 106. I'll put a, video, I'll put a photo up because I did some weights. But basically, I've gone for a 44 tooth front, 6.5 mile bolts, single speed bolts, just if you're looking to update yourself. And this is just, it's absolutely well, sweet as a nut again. It's like, re breathe, re <coughs> pardon me, breathe new light into the old Planet X. The old Planet X, I spoke it right last year, it's a rat bike, so. But new cables, new outers, 44 tooth, and it's absolutely beautiful. I've kept the old 28 on the back for now, just seeing how it, how it rides, but I think I'm going to go 32 or even outlandish 36. But, job done, eh? The old Swiss sides. The only thing I'm not keen on is I've got the old tyres on it. And obviously, I don't know if you can notice that they don't look particularly fantastic. Hutchinson's. But, oh, look at that. No wonder you ain't going very fast. The brake rub on that. Get it sorted. Well, it's only move up. Ah! Spin. And stop. That's got to be at least 10 mile an hour, isn't it? Anyway. Less waffle. 